on Animal Planet, Era Cardinal, Golden Rescue. So the first picture we saw was that of Toby. Yes. Here's Toby live, <laughs> and we have some really great news. Toby was adopted yes, today. Toby, Toby was adopted. I'm so happy about that. How did Toby end up in foster care and, and with you at Golden Rescue? Toby was uh, surrendered um, to Golden Rescue, mostly because where he was living, he was spending most of his time outside. So it, they were having a difficult time handling him and keeping him, so they surrendered him. I think we need to make it very clear, you can't leave a dog out 24-7. It's just impossible with the elements whether it's extreme heat or extreme cold, it's so unfair. Absolutely. If and I'm not passing judgment. They're suffering. These people at least surrendered, but you can't do that. That's right. And Especially I, with this breed. And some people think, well, with this breed, you know, that they're outdoorsy, and they also think, oh, a little wooden <laughs> doghouse no, will do it. It's as long as there's food and water. I mean, that water freezes. That's just a terrible way to live. If it's not good live. for you, it's not good for them. Absolutely. And particularly Goldens, they, they want to be cuddle bugs. Yeah. So he wants to be inside cuddling. So let me ask you, he spent the first 10 of his formative years, I mean, he's only, what, a year and a half? Yeah. <laughs> but Some he spent baby. most of it outside, summer, winter, fall? I think I, we, we were told little, but he spent a lot of time outside. And for a golden like this to have to be loved and share his love. Has this uh, changed his personality? I mean, I just met him, and Completely. he's just wonderful. When he first arrived, he was quite anxious, he's a mm -hmm. bit of a jock marking on things, squirting here and there, and now he's learned all his manners in two weeks. <laughs> well, he's been with you. Now, he's, he's your first foster. What was yeah. that like for you? Uh, it's an incredible experience because knowing where he's going um, for the adoption, he's going to have the best possible life. And to know that we were part of that and to move on and to meet other fosters and goldens that need help, it's really rewarding. You know, people are concerned when they adopt rescues that, about the behavior and they don't necessarily know the medical history. How closely did you work with him to try and encourage him to stop marking and to learn, you know, a little bit better behavior? Goldens um, are... are